Hey guys, Harmony here. In this tutorial, I'm going to basically be showing you guys how to uh, get the Steam Overlay UI and FPS counter in any Origin game. Um, for this example, I'm going to be using Battlefield 4. What you want to do is you want to open up your Steam library, hit Add a Game, a non-Steam game, wait for your programs to let up, and then it, it, you might see Battlefield 4 for example, but don't do that. What you actually want to do, you want to add Origin as a Steam game. After you add selected programs, all you have to do is just launch the game. Another thing that you can do is you can rename it. For example, if I only had Battlefield 4, I could change it to Battlefield 4. And then if I wanted to have, like, uh, Battlefield 3, I could add another shortcut, which is the same origin one, and then I could rename that to Battlefield 3. But that's only if you want to be really specific. After you add it, you just want to hit play. And it should load up origin. Okay, as soon as you have origin loaded up, you should see your game. Now, you won't see any FPS count or anything yet, but that's okay. Uh, basically, all you have to do is hit your game and hit play. Then you can just find a server to uh, to play that game. I'm just gonna go to my favorites and pick a random server. And once your game loads up and it starts and everything, you should be able to see the FPS counter if you have it enabled. And once you get into the game and everything and you're set, um, you can just shift tab and then you should be able to get to the overlay. Okay guys, we are in uh, the game. And as you can see in the top left corner, we have the uh, FPS counter. We have the Steam Overlay, as you can see, you can just open up a web browser, just to be sure. Uh, basically what you would expect if you were in a regular Steam game. And uh, you can also take screenshots, uh, which is really cool. Uh, so if you guys did enjoy this tutorial, um, my name is Harmony, this is my outro, see you in the next video.